How long since your last confession? Never. I see. Why now? I don't know. I wouldn't even know where to begin. I should go. This is stupid. I'm wasting your time. I'm sorry. You would be surprised at the things I've seen and heard. Not like me. I'm a monster. A monster is only as evil as the past he holds on to. I'm a killer. I see. Go on. The one thing I'm good at. Flawless perfection. Do you believe that these lies were worth ending? I never really cared. The way I see it, only the strongest live to see another day. What do you mean? I mean there's a deep dark secret we all keep hidden. We're either strong enough to take it to the grave, or we become weak and die trying to keep it hidden. But the Lord sees everything. Then I must be doing good. Maybe me being a killer is part of God's plan. How so? Because he's made no effort to try and stop me. I've been a hired gun for many years now, and not once has something obstructed me from getting my target. Could it be I'm the Lord's divine killer? It is possible the Lord could anoint one to do such a thing, but I do not believe that you are his appointed killer. Why is that? You used a God-given gift and used it for selfish intent. A man has needs. A true follower of the Lord suppresses his earthly desires. But desire is how I found out I am a killer. You desire to murder? When you find your wife in bed with another man, that is the only thing you desire. Ah, you let anger cloud your judgment. Yes. At first it was out of anger. But after killing them, I felt so alive. Pulling the trigger and seeing the bloody mist that followed was such a rush. A rush so addicting, I continued to kill for employment. But the rush has faded into one thing I fear most. Which is? No longer feeling anything. I started to kill children just to feel the slightest bit of guilt. But nothing. Why would you want to feel the pain of guilt? To feel something. Anything. I'd rather feel the pain of guilt than nothing at all. I just want to be free of this burden. Do you want to be born again by giving yourself to the Lord? Yes, Father. I'm ready. You did the right thing coming here today, my son. It says in 1 John, if we confess our sins, the Lord is faithful and just and will forgive our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Unlike you, I, I have remained pure. You, my son, traded your God-given gift for filthy lucre. You've squandered your talents for desires of the flesh. You are the diseased, toothless dog that preys on God's flock, and I am a protector of his sheep. May God have mercy on your soul. You're good. Took my employer a long time to find you. You kept your dark secret hidden better than most. But you of all people should know, priest. No evil deed goes unpunished. You will burn in hell for this! Maybe you're right, but not today. Much more intimate than a gun, hey? Much more intimate. Thank you, priest.
How long since your last confession? <laughs>